Texas. What have you got for us? Well, good afternoon, Bob, Mary Ellen, and that news from Neil is welcome news here for folks here in Ray County who have been literally pounded the last couple of days with rainwater. And uh, as you'd expect, they're that holding that breath, so to speak, that collective breath, well, they're not breathing easily just yet, thinking that they're still in a lull. The rainy runoff continues as parts of Ray County clean up from flash flooding. Dayton, for the most part, is wet. Low-lying areas are now little more than retention ponds. Evansville, dogged by rain yesterday, is mostly hit-and-miss flooding today. Spring City, meanwhile, is assessing damages while still expecting more rain. Bridge abutments, only months old, didn't fare well. Creeks and streams are being cleared by road crews. But some folks, like Danny Holloway, just wet a line and wait for either more rain or fish, whichever comes first. I've been catching a few catfish down here. A lot of times, every time. Any shoes, television? No, 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 no. <laughs> Not that. <laughs> we can joke a little bit, but you can tell it's a little bit of a nervous laugh from Mr. Holloway here. Now, just how quickly is the water receding? Around noon today, this uh, road behind me was totally underwater. It has since receded four inches in just the hour since we've been back. We'll keep you updated and have the latest coming up on News Channel 9 at 6. For now, that's the story live here in Dayton, Tennessee. Vince Lennon, News Channel 9. Bob, back to you. Thank you, Vince. Again, a reminder that schools in Ray County and Bledsoe County have closed for tomorrow.